so this video uh, is just a small example of why um, the kids um, in uh, other developing countries or, or uh, high developed countries uh, just a small example there's so many other reasons um, develop faster than kids in some other countries this is just a small example because uh, in this video we are looking at this uh, small car this is a truck it's a uh, it's a jeep it's a, it's a jeep uh, jeep rubicon truck you can see the pictures of the truck you can see you can see uh, the car the car looks like a real car for real you can see it sits uh, it sits two people in the front and you can uh, put your luggage in the back and this is a this is a real driving car they drive this car but any kid over five years old can drive this this truck this car all you have to do is charge it uh, it's electric so you have um, you have to charge it once a day it has a battery so this is something that's in encouraged in other countries that's the back of it you can see the back of it it looks like a real car so these kids in some of these developing countries they start they start learning how to drive as, as early as five years old so this is a good example why it should be encouraged even in other countries especially the countries uh, second or third world countries uh, you motivate children to to start learning early so this is just a small example and this car has everything it has a you can see it has a steering wheel it has a gear right there then you can move back and everything you can see the buttons there it's just like a real car and two seats for the driver and the passenger and uh, a place you can they can put their bags so this is just an example why when you see uh, your children learning trying to learn how to uh, some of this basic adult stuff it's good to teach them uh, slowly by slowly instead of killing their uh, their need to learn so this is just a basic video um, to show why this should be encouraged everywhere like when you see somebody trying to build a plane or fix uh, make a radio or a TV in these developing countries second third world countries they discourage that so this truck moves it drives all you have to do is charge it once a day charge it at night you can drive it all day it's for five years old and up but it's recommended for um, carrying only two people that's why it has two seats but it works and again the name is uh, Jeep Rubicon Jeep Rubicon and it's uh, it, it, it might be affordable for most people but it's just an example it doesn't mean you have to get this one this this Jeep you can get a another model or a cheaper model or what you can afford but it's good to encourage the kids to become start becoming independent because uh, nobody knows the future okay uh, let me know if you have any comments or questions about this I'm not being paid by Jeep to advertise this Jeep Rubicon no it was just a a small example 
of what the kids can do. So uh, leave your comments or questions and also please go ahead and subscribe to this channel for more videos like this. Okay.